Hello everybody, it's Mr. Intrigue again. And today, I'm going to take my nice little GT6200D and I'm going to replace a Wi-Fi card in it. Right now, there's nothing wrong with my Wi-Fi card, but I want to upgrade it to the new AC technology. I bought an AC router, so I want to get an AC Wi-Fi card in here to test the speeds. Uh, to do this, you just need three simple tools. A flat tip screwdriver or something to pry with. A small Phillips head screwdriver, very small, you really see that, mm -hmm. and you don't know those pliers. So I bought the Intel 7260, and I'll be putting that in here. So the first thing you want to do, and this is where I messed up on the first time, is you want to open up your case all the way, you know, make it completely 180 degrees, just like that. Uh, and then... You have your case here. Your front panel where all your touch parts are, that's going to pop up. There's four little points or six points in here where you just pry underneath and it'll clip up. So let me go ahead and start by doing that. This angle isn't the best, but you guys can see it better. That's why I chose to do it this way. So you'll see little tabs here. Where's the other one? There's one. There's one. And all the way across. So you'll just want to get up under one of the tabs. It's just like taking off your back case. There's going to be clips. So you just pop that off like so. And then you go around. And you'll do the same for the rest of it. These are solidly made, and I always worry about breaking the clips, but I have yet to break it taking off the back cover or this cover, so that's a good thing. So once you get that off all the way, it'll pop right off, but you don't want to completely pop it off because that's in the way. All right, so now that you have this open, you're going to see your Wi-Fi card right there, and that's what we're going to replace. There's two screws and two antennas. So, we're going to take off these screws. Oh, just one screw, actually. So, that's good. Now, we can pop this card all out. And the an antennas will pop right on off, but I like to use the needle nose just to be on the safe side just like that so now that they're off we'll set that over to the side and we'll get out the new card So here is a nice new card. Let's see if this will focus in on that at all. Uh, and it won't. There we go. So this is going to go in the same way the other one came out. I'm going to put the antennas back on the same way. So they just clip back on there, just like that. And then the other one. I got these big old giant hands. Sometimes it just doesn't help. So when someone tells you it's nice to be tall, there's a lot of things that happen when you're tall. Alright, that's really giving me a fit. So I'm going to take a look at it. Looks good, so let's uh, try it again. Alright, and snap right on there. So now we go ahead and just pop this in there. And put our screw back on.
and we're done. Pretty simple, pretty painless. I just wanted to put, put this out there so everyone can see in their GT60s and GT70s exactly how it's done. Um, just like my last video, if I did something wrong, please tell me in the comments. And uh, hopefully everyone finds this at least educational, if anything. Um, you guys take care. And in the comments, I'll also put down the performance increase from the, the regular N to the AC. My current router is just an 866, uh, and, and so is this Wi-Fi. So hopefully I'll see speeds up around 866. All right, you guys have a good night, and I hope you enjoy.